Hi, my name is Yong Asung, postdoc in Lenslio Polytechnic Institute. Today, I'd like to introduce my work on structural control of polypropylene polymer silica MP nanocomposite by poro polymerization induced phase separation under a confined film geometry. Starting with our materials, polypropylene resins are composed with theta and two EHMA monomers by 3 to 1 weight fraction. Poro initiator is TPO added by 1 weight percent against the poro curable resin. For the poro polymerization phase separation study, we use polyethylene glycol with various different molecular weights and acrylated silicon nanoparticles as the additives. Polyethylene glycol was added 15 weight percent and nanoparticle were added 1 weight percent to the resin. This is the reactive UV transmittance of polyethylene glycol 3400 molecular weight containing resin. UV transmittance was measured on resin in a confined thickness of 100 micros under UV light of 405 nanometer over the time. Under the high UV intensity, the UV transmittance continuously goes up by the consumption of photo initiator. But when the low intensity applied, the UV transmittance goes down. This turbidity originates from photo polymerization induced phase separation. When slow polymerization occurs from low UV intensity, the pad has enough time to phase separate. This results show the silicon nanoparticle effect on the UV transmittance change in pad containing resin along with the UV intensity. Without nanoparticles, the optical turbidity of resin gradually decreases and disappears under the high UV intensity. But in the 1 weight percent silicon nanoparticle composite resin, the optical turbidity is maintained even in the high UV intensity. This behavior can describe this diagram. Left diagram shows the case of cross-link of monomers with a pad. Under the high UV intensity, the resin monomers rapidly polymerize. It results in the pad entrapment without the optical turbidity. In the low UV intensity, PEG has more chance to phase separate from network due to the slow polymerization. It gives the optical turbidity. On the other hand, when the silicon nanoparticle introduced in the PEG resin, the PEG entrapment is hindered by the defect from silicon nanoparticle. So, even in the fast polymerization, the optical turbidity can develop, induced by one weight percent addition of silicon nanoparticle. In conclusion, we studied the effect of nanoparticle addition on polymer additive for poro polymerization induced phase separation. The polymerization induced phase separation of polymer additives was observed by the UV turbidity development. The interaction between nanoparticle and polymer additives can change the polymerization induced phase separation behaviors. It could give a fundamental idea for the structural control of photocurable resin. Thank you for your time and thank you for listening.